everyone. In this scene, Jiang Su ventures out in the middle of the night to work as a substitute driver without informing his family. Meanwhile, Boxen continues to endure a toothache as the pain medication fails to alleviate the discomfort in her teeth. She informs Yunja that she plans to stay up late that night and won't be able to rise early the next morning to prepare breakfast. Therefore, she requests Yunja to handle breakfast duties for the following morning. However, at that moment, Yunja is stressed and perplexed about concealing her lies despite promising to prepare breakfast. When Jiangsu and Doyoung return from their part-time work, they find the house devoid of any food, not even rice. Consequently, they divide the task of cooking rice and preparing the meal between them. Upon waking up and discovering Jiang Su and Doyoung in the kitchen, Buxen becomes furious upon realizing that Yunja has not fulfilled her breakfast making responsibilities. She enters Yunja's room, wakes up her up, and reprimands her for neglecting the morning meal preparation. Yunja, in turn, becomes angry and explains that her sleep troubles prevented her from making breakfast. Believing it was acceptable for Doyoung and Jiang Su to take on the cooking duties, Yunja's frustration intensifies upon hearing Boxen's remarks. As Yunja seldom cooks for the family, a task primarily handled by Boxen, Boxen expresses regret for accepting Yunja as her daughter in law, implying that Yunja falls short of Sun Young's qualities. Yunja becomes irritated by Boxen's constant comparisons to Sun Young prompting Boxun to suggest that Yunja strives to match or at least emulate a fraction of Sun Yang's greatness and goodness. Despite Jiang Su and Boxun's current struggles and evident hardships, it's implied that they must accept their circumstances as karma for past action that harms Sun Yang. Okay everyone, that's the scene for this time. Thank you for watching my video.